Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the vlog. I'm going fishing. It has flat out poured, I'm not joking, poured the last two days. Uh, I went fishing three days ago in the rain, did terrible. Uh, actually, it's still raining right now, but I'm gonna go over to my buddy Tim's house. He has the air conditioning. Um, company that's just amazing and he just mowed the grass down to the the little pond behind his house so I'm gonna go back there and park behind, down there and try to get back there and, and catch some fish I brought frogs that's all I did I brought a frog oh I did bring the new uh, V&M wild shad now you guys haven't seen this one before and I'm in the process of doing a uh, closer look on it but this is a spectacular little swim bait it's like three inches 3.3 inches I think it is in, in size it's got a great body shape it looks just like a shad but it's it's got great thumping action and uh, I've used it a couple times I've actually caught quite a few fish on it but I haven't filmed the fishing because I've been in a spot that I really no offense I just don't anyone want anyone to know where I'm going but I made dinner um, and uh, now I'm heading out in the rain and wish me luck so here we go Get your fish on. How you like them apples, boys? How you like them apples? Little one on the frog. Little baby. So I'm gonna give you guys some helpful hints because I'm gonna do a frog video here soon, but one of the things about frogs is that I like to do is I like the frog legs to be about the same size as the frog body. So I trim them down, trim them down on a little bit of an edge. In this case, I didn't trim this one down at all, but in most circumstances, I would trim those about to right there and cut off that, that part. Here's why. A lot of times you're gonna get short strikes and they're gonna eat, the, they're going after the legs as is. If the legs are so far behind the bait, it doesn't have time to get in there. Ooh, that's a bad cast. We'll make that one work though. So it doesn't have time to get in there. And they're just eating parts where there's no, no hook exposed. So if you want to really do yourself a, a good deed, I know some people like to trim, the, keep their legs as long as possible. If you're in a place that has giant fish, giant bass, then yeah, by all means, make them as big as possible because they're gonna inhale them as is. When you're going places where the fish, is, are, the fish are fairly small and it's a good idea to trim that those legs down a little bit. Anyway, that's what I usually do. Through here. There we go. We're gonna lift it up right there. Oh, that's a much better fish for over here. Well, maybe not.
Oh, he got both. He wasn't going anywhere. There we go. A little bit. Well, I don't know if it's a little bit better. Let's get him into the back of the water. Well, I don't know how the video is going. There's one right there. So I'm heading back out there today, same place I was last night. I did all right last night. I didn't crush it. I think I lost five or six fish, but it absolutely, it poured on me last night. So today the sun is out. It is 714 in the evening. Um, it is exactly 99 degrees outside. So it's hot as hell. But like I said, I'm, I've got two lures, two rods, two lures. One, I've got a frog on because the frogs are ridiculous here. But I also have the new 13 Fishing Lizzie Lizard that I'm gonna try for the first time. And uh, if you're not familiar with Florida, we have a lot of lizards here, a lot of lizards here. And the more south you get, the bigger they get. Some are pretty, pretty scary. And I'm not talking about alligators. So we have lizards here, and generally those get eaten pretty well by bass. So that's what we're gonna use. We've got, uh, we've got a bag of them. We got six left with them. Uh, we got pliers. We've got most of everything I need, but really I've only brought two lures. The lizard and one frog and maybe an extra frog in my Plano bag. I'm not really sure. So we're going to try our best. I'm taking you with me. I hope you guys are having a blessed day. And remember, get your fish on. Get your fish on. Frog cast a lot better. There's one right there. I don't know if it's on still. I got a lot of weeds. Is it there? Or no? Nope, all weeds. See that thing crush that thing? Eat the damn tail. Here is a stud! Boom! Look at that! Boom! Look at that! Mason, look at that thing! Hey, the camera's running, so don't swear. I did not know something was that big in here. That there is a no tail 13 fishing Lizzie Lizard pig. That's a pig. Look at that stud. Pig.
little one. Yeah. Man, that ate my frog so bad. Might have screwed it up. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, click up here. If you want to see our last video, it should be right here. Take your kid fishing, get your fish on. Cheers.